This is not exactly like Woody Guthrie singing for the UAW CIO, I don't guess, but you are working people, right? So, um, the song is called Sticks and Stones for anybody taking notes. Gather wood against the weather Pile up stones against the sky String up bulbs like pearls between us And the heaven's blackest eye Tell the hour, go take another Or go down Moses without a fuss Give in to the lawless water and send that later boat for us sticks and stones blood ash and bone i shake the tree swim out alone turning over the dark missouri now that every new leaf i had is gone near empty a swinging saber keeping every prayer at bay at the throat of love for ransom from the dull approaching day there's no law that rides this border no fences stretch this far to show how times will side against another as one arrives and others go sticks and stones blood ash and bone i shake the tree and swim out alone turning over the dark missouri now that every new leaf i had is gone are dressed in fire and feathers on a beach sit in a row climb the bank through scrub and tender disappear where rabbits go they had nothing that i needed but i gave them all i had just to share some dirt between them as we waited smoked and laughed sticks and stones blood ash and bone i shake the tree swim out alone turning over the dark missouri now that every new leaf i had is gone Now that every new leaf I had is gone. Now that every new leaf I had is gone. Thank you. Thank you. This didn't go far. Everybody here okay? It's worth notice, uh, noting while I'm tuning that I was telling Bob I first became aware of your program because you had my friend Vic Chestnut on here. And I have a song on my new record. I don't know if I can play it now. I don't know if I will, but... Uh, that I wrote about him, or wrote for him anyway. It's not the ballad of Vic Chestnut, but something I wrote as a meditation on him after he passed. What's it called on the record? 
It's called Rumid Arles. So it's named after the Van Gogh painting of the small empty bedroom. And I wasn't trying to be too clever to try to equate Vic with another troubled genius, but um, the idea that Van Gogh had painted this empty room and we knew as much about him from his absence, um, and I think we know as much about Vic from his absence by what he left resonating. I hope we do anyway. But enough about him. Uh, this song is called uh, After the War. A dogged mind sniffed my heart like a pocket full of German marks. Long after the war was through Stood me on a rusted rail Turned my face and kicked my tail Up towards the yonder blue Threw a fish up on the bank I watched him dance from the air he drank and then my hunger knew That star sparks will fly around my head When I stir coals down in my bed Like I was walking back to you Well, time slips out the leaning fence That lost the border ever since Our beloved war took to the road With caravans and mockingbirds And painted girls with twisted words Whose knees and ankles show Now I sit and watch the fading moon The shower stars and coming soon Well the whole thing will look new When blessedly I will forget The ways of God and all regret Like I was walking back Like I was walking back To you Thank you. Thanks very much. I'm going to check my tuning since you're recording this for posterity. Uh, this song is called Odetta. And um, I didn't write it about the great singer Odetta. I mean, I knew I was referencing her, but I tried really hard when I started not to write a song, you know, aimed at her. I was not trying to write, you know, about her, but I was trying to, the character of the song was sort of conjuring her countenance for affirmation, I think. Stitching down 
down this earth So cold and hard Low and tight across my wings And when they're calling over me They're unholy, fitful song Oh, dead eye, oh, dead eye, please carry me along. Is that what you guys do? Like three songs? Um, I might just try one more just because. I have had this one about, uh, about six years or so. It's from 1932. You don't know I don't. But it changed the way I playing. Uh, I don't know. I, I just heard things differently than I'd heard out of a guitar before. And it's a small body. It's very comfortable. And it's black. So it sort of goes out before you like a World Wrestling Federation belt buckle. <laughs> um, but you know, the, it has different overtones. Um, it was a budget guitar when it was made. I mean, Gibson made it and it was, this was $19 when it was a new guitar. Um, Sam Phillips told me you gave her her guitar, is that right? I did. Well, I didn't give it to her. I would have. Um, her ex-husband bought it from me. 
And somehow it might have been part of a settlement. No, I don't think it was a settlement. Uh, I think that she just sort of, you know, once it was in their house, it just became her main guitar. I've never seen her play anything else since that time, and that was, and that was, you know, 20 years ago. But she's really great, and she's one of the people that I saw who, who refused to use a DI on their guitar, and I went to see a show of hers, and she just had a mic out front, and everybody in the band played differently because of that. And I forgot how long it had been since I'd heard the body of a guitar on a stage and not, you know, you spend all this money to buy these old guitars and you baby them and carry them around and then you run a line out of them and they all sound like a nine volt battery afterwards. But when I saw Sam and she was playing this acoustic guitar with just a mic in front, I noticed how different everybody on stage responded to her as a player, how they leaned in to listen and how shockingly different it was as an audience member. Um, this song is called Piano Furnace, and thank you again for having me here. I take it it's a slow news day for all you guys people to be in the... Let's pull this piano out from the wall And clear the young children from out of the hall Stuff it with tender, put paid to it all Let it stoke the fires of the world Let's beat this guitar It was meant to be heard The way our confession is Dragged word by word From out of the mouths Of the sick and the cured Let it stoke the fires of the world Clanging black train cuts through this door, connecting the fears we hadn't before. It leaves them in ribbons and strewn on the floor, tangled as ever we sing. Let's string up that heart from the limb of a tree. Let it swing out above us and buckle our knees. A hymn to the hopeless here, thicker than thieves. Let it stoke the fires of the world. Starts 
stand naked in smoke Sending up sparks Let us stoke the fires of the world Let us stoke the fires of the world Thank you. Thanks for having me. Thank you very much. Thank you. Anything I needed to, to, to cover again, Bob? Is it all right? I mean, yeah. there's a few. Great. I smell lunch. Yeah. <laughs>